Hello, and this is Sunny. Welcome back. Today I will introduce several terms related to wireless access point. BSS, BSSID, SSID, ESS, and ESSID. Wireless LAN is a network where uh, devices are using wireless to communicate with each other in a defined area. Keep in mind that wireless LAN is ultimately connected to a wide network. WAP, a wireless access point simply called access point or AP is a device that accepts wireless signals from multiple devices and retransmits them to the rest of the network. APs may also be known as base stations. APs at home often include routing functions, thus they may also be called wireless routers or wireless gateways in home setting. But in business level, APs and routers are separate devices in general. AP is a layer 2 device because it's like a bridge connecting two types of networks, wireless and the wide network. But these two networks are not separate, they belong to one broadcast domain. In other words, they belong to one local area network. Thus, an AP is just another layer 2 device, like switch, which handles frames and MAC addresses. Basic Service Set, or BSS, is a group of wireless network devices that are working with the same AP. Basic Service Set Identifier, or BSSID in short, is the AP's physical or MAC address, which is 48-bit long hexadecimal numbers, just like your computer's MAC address, same format. As a wireless user, you do not see BSSID, but they are included in wireless packages or frames. Service Set Identifier, or SSID, sometimes called Network Name, is a unique character string used to identify an AP, or Service Set. You can name it by any natural language like Chinese or English or Chinglish. On the AP setting, you might see something like this. But on the wireless device, like your computer, you might see it something like this. As a user, you only care about SSID. You select one from the list on your wireless device and use the network. For a secure wireless network, you may be required to provide your username and a password. By default, an AP broadcast is SSID in its service area. It is the SSID broadcast that you see the wireless networks that are available. One service area can be extended by adding more APs, and this is called Extended Service Set, or ESS. The shared network name is referred to as Extended Service Set Identifier, ESSID. But there is formally no such thing as ESSID in AO2.11 standards. Thus, you can just use the same SSID for ESSID. In an extended service set, every AP broadcasts the same SSID to its users. When you, as a user, walk with your device from one service set to another, 
you are still connected to the same network without knowing you use different service set and different AP. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you very much and see you next time. Oh, don't forget to subscribe.